how to remove third-party apps or services account access to your Google account. The first thing you need to do is open up your browser and navigate to google.com. Once you're here guys, navigate to the top right hand corner here to where it says sign in and left click on the sign in button here and sign into your Google account. So I'm just going to do that now guys. As you can see guys, I'm now signed into my Google account and I'm back on google.com. Navigate to the top right hand corner once again and left click on your profile picture. Once you've done that guys, look for where it says manage your Google account and left click on it. Once done, you'll be in the home section of your Google account. The section that we need is called security, which is the fourth option down on the left hand side here. Once you've found security guys, simply left click on it. Once you're in the security section of your Google account, scroll down until you see where it says third party apps with account access. You gave these sites and apps access to some of your Google account data, including info that may be sensitive. Remove access for those that you no longer trust or use. And as you can see guys, for me it says vidIQ has access to YouTube. To see a list and manage third party access, simply left click on manage third party access here in blue. Once you've done that guys, you'll be in the apps with access to your account. Again guys, I only have one app with access to my account and it's called vidIQ and it has access to my YouTube. To remove this specific site or app that has access to a Google service or your Google account, simply left click on it. You'll then be able to see the details of what this app or site has access to. So as you can see, it has access to YouTube. It has access to manage your YouTube account, view monetary and non-monetary YouTube analytic reports for your YouTube content. It also can see basic account info of my Google account. So it can see my personal info, including any personal info you've made publicly available. And it can also see my primary Google account email address. And then you'll be able to see further details about the app or site, including the homepage, access given to, access given on. To remove access guys, all you need to do is navigate to where it says remove access and left click on the remove access button here. You'll then be greeted with a small window which says remove access. VidIQ will no longer have access to your Google account. You'll need to grant access if you want to use this app or service again. You have the option to cancel or to press OK. I want to remove access guys, so I'm going to left click on OK. And there we go guys, access has been removed from that specific site or app. As you can see guys, Google now says you haven't given any apps or services permission to access your Google account, which is great because that's exactly what I wanted to do. And that pretty much concludes the video guys on how to remove third party apps or services account access to your Google account. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a like, comment down below, and most importantly of all, subscribe to support the channel. I'll see you on the next video. Why is it so hard to live?